Scuba divers, pumpkins, ocean. How does that make sense? Well, today we're going to find out. But first, you're going to hit the like, hit the subscribe button, and the notification bell. Because I'm Chris, this is Just Keep Scuba Diving, and I'm here to help you save money and enjoy the sport of scuba diving at the same time. I do this by reviewing dive sites, dive operators, and going through dives themselves. First, I want to thank Amore Dive Resort for hosting a wonderful, wonderful pumpkin carving contest the first weekend of every October. Next, I want to thank Tiffany over at OceanRebels.org. She also writes for the Keys Weekly, and her articles actually got put into four different things down in Marathon, Esmeralda, the Keys Weekly, and something else. I forgot what it was. I appreciate everything she sent me, so that way I can put the stills. All the still pictures are hers. So she, she put those up for us to use. And then I also think Channel 4 was there. And there was another guy there. And on the boat, he promised, you know, oh, yeah, I'll help you with the video I don't use. And it was, it didn't happen. All right, so how do we start this? First things first, I want to thank Amy Slate for having, <laughs> for having all the pumpkins gutted before we got on the boat. I know that sounds like, oh, my God, what a task. Trust me, it probably was, but we didn't get involved in it. All we did was carve. All right, so we picked our pumpkins up and then jumped in, jumped on the boat. Now on the way out to the boat, we turned around and we got uh, paper towels, dried our pumpkins off, and started carving. Cammie is already in the water here and down at the base, and we've already finished. I Again, I, I didn't know that nobody was going to be handing me film from the actual carving. I am sorry. That was my bad in trusting somebody else on their word. With Kim and them, there was a gentleman that was with them that was, I believe he actually works at the Coral Reef Foundation. This gentleman in the, that is sitting here, he is carving Save Our Corals. And underwater, it looked great. Absolutely fantabulous. Um, but it didn't make it all the way up to the top of the water like it was supposed to. And I think a couple of letters got broke off. Um, as you see, Tammy's in the background. So she's enjoying just sitting on the sand watching everybody else. There is the mom and father. They were dive instructors, retired dive instructors. They were bringing their son out for the first time. I gave Tammy the camera here. I'm actually on the camera. Hi, there, there I am. Hi. Tell, we're in about 26, 25 to 26 feet of water. It is beautiful water, of course. This is actually your second place winner to the left and what should be one of the first or second place winner, the second or third place winner. These people here come from the Destin area and they came down, this was their first time down here. And we really appreciated talking to them and got some great dive sites. The next couple is the couple that came from Michigan, said I believe it is, said they've got their pumpkin in form. They carved it out, put it as a bowl, made the rind in the form of an eel and then put a heart with the light in the back of it. Well, let's, let's go ahead and get our group shot. Get everybody together like we're supposed to.
and then let's try to go ahead and get it up to the water up to the surface now getting to the surface is a little harder than what people think because you've got that extra five pounds in the pumpkin you got to carry with your hands while you try to surface inflate at the surface and then hand up to be on the boat and once you get on the boat yeah, to give the pumpkins to them, you get set up, go ahead, jump back in the water and keep on diving because they're going to judge you up on the boat. No, we did not do judging down on the surf, on the sand. We did it up on the boat. Actually dove on the city of Washington. The city of Washington is a great wreck to dive on. It's really easy. Um, there's actually two cool ways to go. So there's the plates, and then if you follow the anchor chain, you can follow the reef along, and then go down one side of the reef and come back the other, and it was just awesome. Uh, Tammy and I had an awesome dive with that. Then after you do the dive, well, guess what? You got to come up on the boat. Come up on the boat, and bam, your car, your pumpkins are judged. Loved everybody that was on the boat. Come up, and lo and behold, it was it was Tiffany and them that won second place. People that were from Michigan, they run first place, and I believe the anchor guy won third place. I'm not sure. Maybe our destined people. Anyway, so that's it. That's how you carve a pumpkin. That's a pumpkin carving contest underwater. When you say it, you gotta smile. My name is Chris. This is Just Keep Scuba Diving. Scuba Diving on a budget. If you like what I'm doing, hit the like, hit the subscribe. And I will see you next time and see you out on the boat.